Hi again. Scott Reitz uh, served in the Los Angeles Police Department for many, many years and he was a member of the Metro Division, which is an elite section of LAPD. They have to go through a selection process to get into uh, Metro and it, it's a high intensity um, crime suppression unit and one of the sections of Metro is SWAT and it's a, a fair, further um, process to get into SWAT who, who are the famed special weapons and tactics team and um, Scott Reitz served in, in SWAT and uh, the book he's written uh, The Art of Modern Gunfighting um, is um, as the title implies it's, it's about the fight and uh, he is um, well qualified to uh, write about that because he has been in numerous gunfights and in the book he um, analyzes his gunfights he went several years I think it was 11 years before his first gunfight and uh, he, he talks about that breaks it down etc and then exactly a week later he was in his second um, that, that again is analysed and he, he totaled five uh, gunfights offer it to involve shootings in his career and he also investigated loads more so he is um, very very well qualified to speak on the subject and he, he is a great an, uh, analyst of gunfighting uh, he gives lessons learned in, in a very very um, concise and easily understood way. Uh, a chap that I had the pleasure of, of meeting in the United States, Darrell Bolke, was uh, a firearms instructor with another police department in Southern California. And they went to LAPD, or he went to LAPD for his firearms training and he trained with the Metro guys, uh, one of whom was Scott Reitz, also uh, Helms and Mudger. And uh, um, Daryl made very um, a number of observations about the t the training and the drills they did, and uh, how they presented the firearms. It was a very um, systemized method, um, and it was proven. It worked, and, and they they used it many many times in combat. Uh, in the um, in the book, he, he talks about um, being deployed during the uh, the riots after the Rodney King verdict and so on, uh, and analyzes um, what it was like operating there for uh, days on end. Uh, LAPD SWAT was a very, very high, and is a, a very, very high level unit. It it really was the model uh, for major city SWAT teams uh, they they were a full-time unit they were selected they were very very highly trained in all aspects and all the different options um, and indeed when uh, Scott Reitz was uh, a member of, of SWAT the US military really weren't doing very much uh, it was a, a, a time of a lot of peace and the big city SWAT teams were really the experts at, at their gunfighting. So that's another reason why the lessons in the book are, are so uh, relevant. Uh, apart from the uh, gunfight lessons, there's a lot in the book on technique. And um, the major technique taught is um, taken from Gunsight, from Jeff Cooper's system, uh, which LAPD SWAT embraced they uh, went to the 45 auto for example and um, it worked for them they they made it work and uh, they they liked it uh, but he, he does present uh, alternatives the the modern isosceles and so on in the book and discusses the pros and cons of it so all in all it is one of the major books on this on the subject written by somebody who is more than qualified to talk about it and write about it and I think everyone 
who is interested in firearms will really get a lot out of this book, The Art of Modern Gunfight.